It's 12 o'clock on Sunrise Boulevard. While most people are in bed only dreaming of trimmer tummies, these fitness freaks are burning the midnight oil to burn off the bulge. This is the midnight exercise class at the Hot Legs Aerobics Studio in Fort Lauderdale. Midnight? What are these people, nuts? Well, maybe, but on any given weeknight, there are at least a half dozen midnight masochists flexing their pecs here, and most of them are nurses who work the late shift. Oh, it's great. It's the best time for us to exercise, like I said before. It's hard to get up early in the morning and go out and exercise and then get all sweaty and then go to work. So a lot of us never exercise, and this is the best time. Isn't it just a bit odd to be jumping around at 12 at night? Yeah, for us, and it's a great release for me for after work. I can work out a lot of my stress and a lot of my anxiety that way. And I really, really love it. Craig Benedict, owner of Hot Legs, dreamed up this midnight madness two months ago. He even offers an aerobics class at 3 a.m. And now he's thinking about putting in a 24-hour juice bar and 24-hour tanning facilities. I'm just making it more convenient for everybody. There, no one has an excuse not to work out anymore. And this isn't the only midnight muscle emporium. <laughs> Here at Olympiad Health and Racquet Club in Boca Raton, you can bicycle to the beat of the Johnny Carson Show, pump iron until 2 a.m., and then play racquetball or squash until the morning light. And many of these late-night bodybuilders are regular 9 to 5ers. Today I got up 7 o'clock in the morning, went to work, worked 10 hours, got off, went home, had dinner with my wife, got dressed, came back here, played racquetball with my friends here for a couple hours, and come in here, gonna work on a cardiovascular and go home and die. <laughs> and a lot of the nine to fivers I spoke with who enjoy this late night exercise say the advantage is that you have the place to yourself, you don't have to wait online for the machines, and at the Olympiad in Boca, there is another advantage. People who are non-prime time members, that means you go there after 9.30, only have to pay half price. But from one nine to fiver who has experienced this, I'm exhausted. I have to go to sleep after covering that story. <laughs>